Hi students today we are discussing trigonometric identities part 4 that is exercise 8.4 question number 5 fifth part the question is prove that cos a minus sin a plus 1 whole divided by cos a plus sin a minus 1 equal to cos k plus cot a see here uh, left side is in the terms of cos and sin but we need the answer in terms of cosec and cot how will you get cosec and cot from the question if we divide each and every term with sin a we will get the terms with cosec and cot so see let's see lhs will be cos a by sin a minus sin a by sin a Plus one by sine whole divided by cos a by sine plus sine by sine minus one by sine. Here, what we had done, each and every term of the left side we have to divide with sine. Okay. Now, what will be the terms? Each terms we have to change. That means it will be cot a minus one plus cos k by cot a plus one minus cos k because cos a by sin a is cot a and sin a by sin a we know that it is it will be one and one by sin a is cos k. Now I am going to rearrange the numerator as cot a plus cos k minus one divided by cot a plus one minus cos k. Here In the numerator, cot a plus cos k minus one. That one we are going to change in terms of cot a and cos k. We know the identity. The third identity. What is the third identity? Cos k square a minus cot square a equal to one. So instead of one, I wrote cos k square a minus cot square a. Is it clear? Now uh, look at the bracket. In the numerator, what it is of the form a square minus b square, and we know that a square minus b square is a plus b into a minus b. Here a is cos k and b is cot a. So we have to change the numerator cot a plus cos k minus. We must put one more bracket because two terms, two brackets are coming inside. So cos k plus cot a into cos k minus cot a a plus b into a minus b form, and see look at the bracket cos k cot a plus cos k is common cot a plus cos k and cos k plus cot a are both are same, so it is common. So we have to take that outside. So it will be cot a plus cos k into don't forget to put the bracket one minus. Cot a plus cos k we took outside, so remaining one only. One minus second bracket cos k minus cot a, whole divided by one minus cos k plus cot a. And that denominator also I have rearranged. Okay, now in the numerator look at the box bracket after one. That means one minus one more bracket we can see. Is it clear? So we have to change the sign of each and every term in that bracket. So it will be cot a plus cos k that first bracket into that box bracket one minus cos k plus cot a by one minus cos k plus cot a. I think now you have realized why I have changed the denominator also. I have rearranged only. I did not change only rearrangement. I have done and. Numerator and denominator one minus cos k plus cot a is common, so we can cancel that, and so answer is cot a plus cos k. That is the right side. Okay, is it clear? It is very important question, and two identities means trigonometric identity cos x square a minus cot square a equal to one is applied and. A square minus b square equal to a plus b into a minus b. That identity also applied in this question. So it's very important question. Study it well. Thank you.